Titanium, in less than 50 years, has become a leading industrial metal with a wide range of applications. Its versatility guarantees that it will become of even greater importance in the 21st century. Member companies of the Titanium Information Group have produced this video to show you where titanium is currently used and encourage you to look into future applications of this lightweight, high-strength, corrosion-resistant engineering metal and its alloys. Every day around the world, thousands of tons of titanium are airborne in countless military and civil aircraft. Titanium has become a major factor in the development of modern airliners that has made the global expansion of air travel possible. Titanium is as strong as steel, but 45% lighter, stronger than the best aluminium alloys and able to operate at much higher temperatures. More than 50 tons of titanium alloys are used in every Boeing 747. Titanium comprises almost 10% of the weight of the Boeing 777, the high-strength beta titanium alloy undercarriage accounting for a near doubling of the amount of titanium used compared to earlier aircraft. Aero engine thrust to weight ratios depend on the high strength and light weight of titanium alloys. Powerful engines such as the Rolls-Royce Trent would not work without titanium alloys in the huge front fan and the compressor section. Depend upon it if there is one metal that will sustain the development of aircraft and spacecraft too, it will be titanium. On the ground, thousands of miles of titanium tube in steam condensers help keep electricity flowing from power stations around the world, essential to industrial development and growth and improved living standards for all. Similar quantities of titanium tube in desalination plants provide fresh water reliably to the driest parts of the earth. Modern power stations are fitted with gas cleaning equipment to help reduce acid rain damage to the environment. Titanium linings protect the insides of their chimneys and ducts. In chemical and petrochemical plants, thousands of square meters of titanium operate in vessels, pipework, pumps and valves, frequently handling some of the most aggressively corrosive media known. The products of these plants include synthetic fibers, fertilizers, fuels and other products essential to modern living. Titanium, the strong, lightweight, corrosion resistant and most versatile of metals, is also in service offshore, helping to deliver vital supplies of oil and gas safely and efficiently in this hostile working environment. Titanium is immune to corrosion in seawater. In ships and on platforms, fire resistant titanium tubes and pipes stand ready and reliable for emergency duty. Above and below the surface of the sea, titanium is the ideal metal for a wide range of critical applications. Many modern stylish buildings are titanium clad or fitted with titanium roofs. Lightweight titanium structures can reduce the first cost of buildings as well as providing for longer life and reduced maintenance. On a personal level, many thousands of people have a day-to-day -day contact with titanium in the form of wristwatches, spectacle frames or jewellery. For others, titanium is used for heart valves and in dental implants. It has replaced worn or damaged joints or helped repair broken bones. Titanium microsurgical instruments are regularly used in operations for the restoration of sight. Across the spectrum of sporting and leisure activities, titanium is rarely far away. Golfing enthusiasts can get improved performance from titanium clubs. Mountain and racing bikers choose titanium frames and components. Sports and racing car users have long specified titanium for a wide range of high performance components. Titanium springs can be one-third the weight of their steel counterparts and are of considerable interest to the automotive industry, seeking reduced weight and improved fuel consumption. Thrust SSC could not have broken the world land speed record without the aid of titanium. 
Protected by lightweight titanium armor and fitted with many titanium parts, tanks and other fighting vehicles can maneuver more quickly and effectively on and off the battlefield. There will always be plenty of titanium to satisfy these growing demands. Titanium is the fourth most abundant metal in the Earth's crust. Rutile ore, titanium dioxide, exists in large, easily mined deposits. Conventional metal processing by forging, hot and cold rolling, extrusion, drawing and other methods of manufacture provide a complete range of semi-finished or mill products. Titanium castings weigh from a few grams to several tons. Hot working or machining, hot or cold fabrication and welding are used to provide finished products in a wide range of titanium alloys suitable for service continuously at temperatures of up to 600 degrees Celsius, resisting creep and oxidation, or down to liquid nitrogen temperatures with no reduction in toughness, or to survive indefinitely without corrosion in seawater or other harsh environments. Recycling of titanium turnings, solid scrap and life-expired parts is routine. Research is continuing to improve the performance and cost-effectiveness of titanium so as to increase the benefits from its wider use. Titanium is the metal of achievement used in the most advanced applications, yet in everyday use in all kinds of products throughout the world. In critical and demanding applications, there is no other metal, today or tomorrow, that can approach, economically or technically, the performance of titanium. Ask yourself if you should be more familiar with its properties and applications. For more information, contact any member of the Titanium Information Group.